Hi. Welcome to Vedic Mathematics. Today we are going to see the multiplication of a number with uh, a number with all nines. Right? And here we are going to see uh, solve this problem using uh, two Vedic principles. Vedic Mathematics principles. Ekan Yunena Purvena and Nikilam Navatas Charamam Dasitaha. Let us see how. Suppose we want to multiply a number with uh, a single nine or nine nine, double nine or triple nine, whatever may be the number of nines in this, we can multiply it. Let us see how. We get uh, three cases. Uh, that is, when you want to multiply a number with uh, all nines, it can have less than number of less than this number of digits. Here we have three digits. We are going to multiply with the less number or maybe with the same number of nines in this or with the more number of nines. These three cases we are going to deal here. Now, suppose we have equal number of nines. A small example will take it. 89 multiplied with the 99, right? Now, to multiply this, we use a principle uh, called ekan yunena purvena. The meaning of it is by one less than the previous. Suppose if we have whatever the number we have, one less to the that uh, previous number. Let us see how. Suppose you take uh, 87, we are going to multiply, right? With, so you take 87 minus 1, less 1, right? Subtract 1 from this you get 86. So we take this 86 on the leftmost side of this solution. Next, uh, we use another principle called Nikhilam Navatas Charamam Dasata. This is called uh, in the last uh, we take 10 and all the remaining, all the nines. Right? And if you are not well versed with this, please uh, go through my previous videos. We have discussed this uh, principle very much in detail. Right? So here we take the last number 10 and the remaining on the left side all nines. Here we have only one digit on the left side. So we have taken one single nine. Now subtract this number from 10. 10 minus 7, 3. 9 minus 8, 1. That's it. We get the answer. The solution for this is 87 into 99 is 8613. So simple. But uh, so here to solve this, we are using two principles, Ekan Yonena Purvena and uh, Nikhilam principle, Nikhilam Sutra, we can call it as. So let us see another example. We want to multiply a three digit number with a three digit number with all nines. So here, if you take it, first one, Ekan Yonena Purvena, that is uh, one less, 159 minus one, that is 158. Put this on the leftmost side of this. Next, Nikhilam Sutra, the, in the end, we take 10 and uh, on the other side, 9. So subtract these numbers from this. 10 minus 9, 1. 9 minus 5, 4. 9 minus 1, 8. So the solution for this is 1,58,841 when you multiply this number with the triple nine. Clear? Next. Suppose you take a, a bigger number, six digits, and I want to multiply this with six. Whatever may be the number of four digits you have, you are going to do the same thing here. So don't worry by just seeing the number of digits. So here we are going to use the principle ekan yonena one less. You need not even write it here just for your understanding. I have written. So take the same number minus one. You get uh, uh, six seven nine four eight five. Right. So one less. Write that number on the leftmost side. And in Iklam Sutra. So here ten on the end. And here you see all the nines. This is the meaning of it. Nikhilam Navata, all nines. And in the end, Charamam Dasataha. In the end, 10. So just subtract these numbers 10 minus 6, 
4, 9 minus 8, 9 minus 4, 5, 9 minus 9, 0, 9 minus 7, 2, 9 minus 6, 3. So this is the uh, answer to this multiplication, multiplication. So if you just see and if you want to just manipulate or multiply these six digit number with the six digits, it takes a very long time. But here, just within less than a minute, you can just get the solution. So this is the answer to this. Next, more number of nines are there, suppose. We have taken a 68 multiplied with 999. Here we have only two digits, but we are going to multiply it with the three digit number. What happens? How to do it? You make it equal by the insignificant value. In the left side, if you put any zero, it's of no, it doesn't change the value. So we are going to put the zero here. And that means treat this as three digit number. This is also a three digit number. So our principle is same. We can apply the same principle. So one less 68, 0, 68, minus 1. So 67 here. Next, Nikalam Sutra, 10, 9, 9. Don't forget to take a 9 here. Even though you have taken a, a 0 in the insignificant position, in the left side it's of no use, no value. But still, when you are applying Nikalam Sutra, we have to use this. So 10 minus 8, 2, 9 minus 6, 3, 9 minus 0, 9. So our answer to this 68 multiplied with the 999 is 67,932. That is the answer. So like this, we can apply to any number, any type of number. Even if it has only three digits in this and I'm going to multiply this with a five digit number. No problem. The thing is, what to do? You all know it. So, add two zeros in the left side. And apply the first rule, 728 minus one, one less. So, I'm taking 0, 0, 7, 2, 7, one less. And Nikalam Sutra, 10, 9999 9, 9, 9. all lines. Subtract 10 minus 8, 2, 9 minus 2, 7, 9 minus 7, 2, 9 minus 0, 9, 9 minus 0, 9. So this is the answer to this question. 728 multiplied with the 99999. 9, 9, 9. So we got the answer here. So like this, we'll be applying to uh, multiplication when you have equal or more number of nines. So far we have seen. Now we are going to see the number with the less number of nines in the multiplication. So here I'm going to multiply 123 with the just 99. We have 99 only, two digits. Here we have three digits in this. Going to multiply this with only two digit number. So what to do? Here is a simple technique is there. We will use that. Write 123 here. See 123, right? I'm writing 99 here, right? And here I'm removing this part, the two digits, because we have two digits here. I'm rounding off two digits in the given number, removing them altogether. And going to add one here to the remaining this number just i'm going to add one and we get plus two right and we are going to do another simple procedure we take the same number here 123 and from this 123 we subtract two here this number whatever you get here in the top you would remove this number so subtract this number and you get one, two, one. Put this one, two, one in the left side, right? And now apply this Nikhilam Sutra to only two digits because we have only two digits here. Apply this 
to only these two digits 10 minus 3 7 and uh, 9 minus 2 7 so like this you get uh, 123 multiplied with 99 we get 12177 so with this small modification when you have less than number of nines we can get the solution to any big problem any number of digits can be there in that we can multiply that so here let us see another example 489 multiplied with the 99 so here again i am taking a 489 99 identify the number of my digits in this and identify the number of digits here that's we are just identifying the number of digits that's all so two digits are there on the left right side rightmost side you must remember so remove these numbers two numbers here also two two these are removed add one to this we get a plus five right and subtract this five from this number so how 489 minus five gives 484 put this 484 in the leftmost side of the number uh, solution and again now you have to use nikilam sutra 10 9 you may ask one question here because here we have three digits why you are not putting nine here as i told you you just really have to remember because we have two digits only in the multiplied the multiplication number you only use two numbers here that's all not all you may have eight numbers seven numbers but only depending on the number of nines you have to use this so 10 minus 9 9 minus 8 1 10 minus 9 1 so we get the answer 489 into 99 gives 48411 that is the answer to this so you can take any big value suppose i am taking a uh, 999 only three digits but here we have five digits 76,486 now i am going to multiply this with the three digit number 999 so again the same principle where you take uh, the given number and uh, i am taking the uh, nines here only you have three nines so you have three nines identify this number of nines here and remove the number of numbers from the digits on the right side you have to please remember only in the right side you have to remember this remove the numbers so remove them you are left with the 76 only now what to do add one always add only one plus one that gives 77 now you take the number as it is, given number 76,486 as it is, but subtract this 77. Subtract whatever the number you got here, subtract it and you get the value. That is 76,409, right? Only thing is you have to do this and put this number 76,409 in the leftmost side of your answer. So I'm putting this 76409. Okay. And here, because I have three digits, three nines, right? I will be applying the Nikalam Sutra only to these three numbers, like 10, 9, 9. That's all. Not to these two. Please remember. Clear? Now. Subtract this 9 minus 4, 5, 9 minus 8, 1, 10 minus 6, 4. This is the answer to your multiplication. So 76,484, when multiplied with the 999, we get this answer. Clear? So like this, we can apply the multiplication of any number with any number of nines, nine series, you can call it. So that's how we get the answer very easily in a matter of seconds, few seconds.
with this we have completed the multiplication with the nine you can visit my other videos on vedic mathematic principles and there we have so you can see the multiplications and subtraction and addition also okay hope you like this video thank you